Hey everyone, it's Trey. I have my first unboxing for Operation Christmas Trail 2022. Um, this box actually, I, I actually started it last year and I didn't finish it. Um, it is for boy two to four. It is packed, but not quite as packed as my other ones have been turning out. And as you can see, I'm using this soft, it's like a hair elastic, but it's like two times the size. Um, because elastics are garbage and they most likely throw them in the garbage at the processing center. And this can be reusable and I'm hoping that they stick it in the box once they're ready to tape it. So a little elastic there. Um, this is definitely a theme. Uh, when he opens it up, this is what he will see. It is a farm slash chick theme. <laughs> I actually was going to do a Dalmatian dog, but I skipped. I opted out on the Dalmatian dog. I, s I changed it around a little bit. Um, on top, I am putting these disclaimers. Um, I made this one up myself. Um, some of you are doing them as well uh, since I'm in Canada and uh, different things can't be shipped that can that you guys can ship and vice versa. Um, for example, we cannot send um, poker face playing cards. Um, I forget what else. Dice, we can't send dice, although dice isn't on my list. But just to help them because my boxes, as you know, are very well packed. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Um, I'm probably going to have to cut myself out a little bit for room. So this is the chick box. Uh, he's got some sunglasses. Very important. Um, most of our boxes, well, they have been for quite some time being going to um, warm countries. Um, his plush is this really, really cute little chick that is a tie. He's really fluffy and he's got um, glittery little feet and he has glitter on the bottoms of his wings. Uh, his name is Lemon Drop. <laughs> Very cute little duck. Uh, he has some little finger puppets. I think there's three. Maybe there's just two. One is every little chick. And one is the cow. Very cute. He's got a maraca for some noise. He's got one of these balls. These plastic balls. I guess they're called wiffle, wiffle balls. Or at least they are in our store where I got them. So he's got a ball to play with. He's got a plastic container uh, with his soap in it. And I am, this is one of my last few containers. I love packing these containers for the toddlers or any other box really. Um, so they have something to store their soap in. But um, our dollar stores haven't got them back since last year. He's got one of these foldable frisbees, which I hope won't hurt him when he takes it out because they're quite um, fast and unfolding, but they're really fun. So as you can see, we've got a lot of yellows and greens going on. Um, he's got a washcloth. He's got, um, I've been putting his, or I've been putting in general now. Um, I used to put his, uh, their nail clippers and files and stuff in with their soap, but I'd like them to have a separate, doesn't really make much sense because once they use the soap, they can't store this in with the soap. Um, so I'm just putting them in little organza bags so they can um, have something to keep them in. 
So now clippers and files. He's got two toothbrushes in here. He's got uh, an adult size one and a kid one that has a cover. Um, he has, this is pretty much his main toy. Um, I made this bag. I know it's really oddly shaped, but I had to make it this way because what's in it. Um, the fabric's really cute. And as you can see, there's little chicks on there as well. Um, the, uh, there's little uh, Duplo blocks in here, so he has a cow. There's his chick. Uh, he also has a pig, a rooster, and he's got a little farmer boy. And he's got four uh, fences, and they can snap together. to make a fence for all his little animals. So that's pretty much his wow toy. Uh, he's got a sharpener that is loose in the box here. A eraser, also loose. Um, he does have a face mask. I don't know if I'm really gonna send. I still have a lot of them, but I don't know if they're really needed anymore, but um, He's got his pack of crayons. He's got one of these cups, which I absolutely love. Um, I wanted to buy them last year and I didn't really get down to it, but uh, I want them for my toddler boxes because the other ones I put the water bottles in, um, they come with a lid and a little, um, carrying thing and they are compact silicone cups and they got a little stainless steel rim really really cool easy to a lot easier to um, pack in these boxes and you could probably fit something little in inside as well but I love these they're kind of hard to find uh, for a good price, but he's got a little dinky car. That's a little duck. He's got a pair of socks. He's got this little memory card game that's of farms. Um, those are. what the cards look like. There is a chicken there and a rooster, a cow, horse, pig, tractor, and a barn. Whoopsie. So he's got a little memory card game. This is his bag. That's the same fabric as his um, bag that has the Duplos in it. He's got this cute little board book that is of farm animals, rooster, pig, cow, and horse. He's got his pencil case. Um, he's got a black pen in here. He's got an orange and yellow marker. Oh, he's got a blue pen too. Oh, and he also has a green marker. And six normal pencils. One that's got the um, teddy bear cat, or not a cat cover, um, helps him hold the pencil. And four novelty colored ones. He's got a fork and a spoon. 
He's got some print offs here. Where did that go? Oh, that went in here. Along with some stickers. So he's got these stickers. He's got those stickers. Those ones. Those ones. And those ones. He's got two of these make a face ones, a cow and a pig. Uh, and he's got this one, which is, I gave him a, I think it's a beak, <laughs> and eyes and a bow tie for this little chick picture. And then his coloring pages. This one was out of a big um, coloring pad. This one has um, a little chick sticker where you put in the shadowy shape there. Uh, he's got this one. This one. This one. I don't want to emphasize all on chickens, so I am expanding a little bit. <laughs> that one. And there's cute chickens. So those are his coloring and activity stickers. I did make him a play mat um, so he can um, play with his toys on it or um, use it for his memory game. And that's what it looks like. Really cute. I've been, I've been having a difficult time finding clip art. <laughs> um, Preferably that is the transparent clip art because I like to, um, you know, have the dog is overlapping the grass, but he's not blocking the grass out. Um, so I've been actually buying packs of um, transparent clip, off, clip art off Etsy and they're really not that inexpensive or they're really not that expensive. Um, And I'll use them multiple times, so that's what I've been doing for clip art. It's got a yellow comb in here. Um, I decided to be to send. I used to send two notebooks, uh, one blank and one lined, and I've decided I am going to send three this year. Um, I know they can practically erase pages to reuse them, but. Um, I think paper is one of those kind of essential things that they should have. So this is just a blank one that I made. So he can draw and color on. And then we have a, a lined one and another lined one. And then we have our my letter um, with our picture in it. And on the very bottom, he has a yellow bandana. So that's my first box. I'm not sure how this video viewing looks. Let me know if it's good or should I just revert back to looking down at everything and, you know, just seeing my hands go. But um, that's my first one for 2022. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, take care and God bless.